Here in this video, I am going to show you that how you can display all the products with all of its uh, color variants. Currently on my screen, you can see that I have displayed all the products with single variant. So first example, I have this t-shirt product. So I am clicking on it and here you can see that I have different colors with the same t-shirt. So how I can display all the colors on this uh, product listing page. So I, if I am adding my code, then after if uh, I will refresh the page, then all the color variants would be displayed on this screen. I mean, uh, t-shirts with different colors would be displayed on the listing page. So this is how you can actually connect your customers. And of course, the customers are attracted to one of the product, one of the color, and they will definitely buy from you. So uh, first of all, uh, I'm going to add the code which I have created. So you can also copy and paste it. And uh, then you can also uh, implement it into your store. This video is for uh, Shopify debut theme. So I have installed debut theme. So let's go to the dashboard of the Shopify store. Here you can see that I have installed debut theme. So this is the current version. Here on the dashboard, you can see that I have installed debut theme. So this video is specific for the debut theme users. For other themes, I have also uploaded the videos. Uh, uh, you should uh, search for different themes and definitely you will get the video over it. First of all, I need to go to and uh, go to the themes. Then you need to click on three dots and click on edit code and here I need to follow some documentation so you will see here that we have some folders and files you need to click on snippets then click on add a new snippet and here I am going to uh, add a name so I have already created some files so this is the first name here so I am going to put it over here I need to remove this liquid dot liquid because it is automatically generated here click on done so this file name is product dash card dash grid dash variant dot liquid and the second file is product dash card dash list dash variant so again i need to click on add a new snippet paste it and remove this dot liquid and click on done so once you are done with all this then you need to open both these files so this is the first file which is product dash guard dash grid dash variant so i am going to copy this code and then after paste it here product dash card dash grid dash variant dot liquid and then click on save again i need to go to open product dash card dash liquid dot uh, list dot variants i am going to copy this code again and paste it inside of this file click on save the changes and finally we have to modify our collection dash template dot liquid so here you need to find out collection dash uh, click on sections then we have collection dash template dot liquid so i need to replace this whole file with another file so here you can see that collection dash template dot liquid i need to open this file and let's copy the whole bunch of code and then paste it over here first of all i need to select all the lines remove it and then paste the new code then click on save the changes once you save the changes then if i am refreshing this page now you can see that all the colors with the same t-shirts are displayed here so this is how you can actually implement it into your store so this is really amazing feature because uh, uh, if you have different colors uh, for a specific product and you are interested to show to your customers with different variants so this is how you can actually uh, uh, you can actually add it for your customers so here we can also hide this red yellow black green so these are actually color variants here so if you want you can also remove these uh, color variants from here uh, so this was specific for debut theme for other themes i am also going to upload it if you have any suggestion you can also recommend me and i will definitely uh, create the video over it so thank you so much for watching this video if you are thinking this video was useful then please like this video also subscribe this channel thank you once again see you in the next video